Guys, before the video starts, I'm giving away a AK-47 Frontside Misty Field Tested. So if you want to enter, subscribe, like the video, set your like playlist to public. And for extra entries, just go to the gleam.io link below. And good luck. Yo, what's up guys? It's Swippin here, back with another video. I've been away for a long time. I went to LA and... Um, I got operated so I couldn't get any videos onto YouTube but today I'm back with kind of a skin video where I'll be showing the best knives under and for a hundred dollars so in this video I'm going to be showing you the prices on the steam market and the prices on bid skins Bitskins, if you don't know what Bitskins is, is another market for skins. It's similar to OP skins. I prefer Bitskins over OP skins because the site is just smoother. It only displays CSGO skins and on OP skins, they display H1Z1 and Dota 2 items, I guess. And yeah, let's head right into the video. So guys, coming at number 5, we got a gut knife tiger tooth coming at about $90 on Bitskins. I'll be posting the Steam price on the bottom left of the screen if you want to buy it off Steam. But coming at $90, the gut knife tiger tooth factory new is such a clean skin and if you're rolling a uh, yellow inventory this fits perfectly to your inventory so basically what the tiger tooth is is a yellow knife that has kind of brown stripes on it that would make it look like the camo or the skin type of the tiger so overall this gut knife is really nice as you can see on some of the factory new ones, the edges of the knife right here and maybe on this face are a little bit worn off but that's with most gut knives. If you get a really really low float you probably won't see them. At number 4 is going to be another gut knife, Marble Fade. So this is similar to the Tiger Tooth just with kind of a marbleized camo with blue, yellow and red. So this gut knife is also factory new. In this video I'm going to go over kind of the nice looking ones, not the nice for $100 that you just want to get for trading or gambling but the ones that you want to use in game that look really nice so the tiger tooth and the marble fate they're factor new and they both look good so as you can see the edges are worn off here again so this is spot number four an honorable mention goes to the gut knife doppler which is I think $83 on OP skins. This is very similar to the past two knives that I showed you. This one would be displayed as number three. This is just a feature to the other two knives. This um, knife is very popular. Also the kind of um, style, the Doppler style is very popular. So if you don't want to get the other two knives, you can also get this nice gut knife so guys coming at number three is not going to be a gut knife it's a bowie knife case hardened this goes around the hundred dollars hundred and seven dollars i think but in this case it's battle scarred i know i said i'm going for the better looking knives but this had a whole lot of blue on it um the case hardened is kind of this steel that rots blue well if you can get it blue enough so we had two gut knives and i think this bowie knife battle scarred case hardened comes at number three 
at $107. Guys, you may not think that one of the newer knives are $100 or under, but these Shadow Daggers Ultra Velvet are, and in my opinion, these are one of the cleanest skins, well, knife skins under $100. So we got the purple ultraviolet right there, and then this nice skin of blackish gray, and this goes for about $90, and I think if you have kind of the default vanilla skins, let's say the USPS and the M4S, they kind of look similar to this gray here, this gray black here and I think the ultraviolet would just shine with the default skins so I think I would pick these shadow daggers at minimal wear. Shadow daggers might not be the coolest skins to have but people call them butt plugs but I don't think they look too bad you know they're kind of stylish they're kind of another knife all of the other knives you hold in the actual palm of the hand, this one you kind of have at your knuckles. So this knife comes at spot number two at $90. So at number one, we got the M9 Bayonet Rust Coat. And in my opinion, this looks pretty good in game if you don't mind the M9. If you don't like the M9, I think the other um, knives are pretty good. But this comes in battle scar condition at $103. You might be thinking, why battle scar? It just looks crap. But actually, battle scar on a rust coat, in my opinion, and many other people's opinions, I think it looks the best. You don't have to go for the factory new one. So this comes at the number one spot.